Swole Benji here. Today I'm going to teach you how to go over the storage limit in any town. So let me just show you what that is. If you look at the storage shed, you can see that I have 787 pounds out of 1,150 pounds. And you'll see it here, order expired, and it's being sent to Brightwood. That is actually perfect timing. I did not plan that. Uh, so let us let me show you Brightwood storage, okay? So first off, my territory standing for Brightwood is only level 10, and I don't own houses in this game. I have never bought a house, except for the betas. Anyway, let's look at Brightwood storage, shall we? Check it out. 580 pounds in refining reagents. It doesn't even display how much for smelting, but I can tell, <laughs> tell you right now, just look at these numbers. This is several thousand pounds, like this is a thousand pounds, that's a thousand seven hundred, that's nine hundred... Um, 800 there, um, 1,000 in gunpowder, and so on and so forth. We have 900 pounds in leatherworking, almost 3,000 in weaving, 1,900 in woodworking, 1,400 in stone cutting. You get the idea, right? And, uh, so how did I do this? How did I cram all this stuff into one town where, uh, you know, <laughs> you can't, you can only store up to 1,000, but also, more importantly, how do I sell things from Brightwood, okay? Because I just had an auction end, and um, let me teach you how that works, okay? And I'm going to show you an example of First Light. So we're in First Light. My storage is not full, and I keep having stuff, uh, sell orders expire, my bad. Um, so storage shed, right? Uh, 700 out of 1,100, right? As long as you have some space in your storage shed, you can sell things from what you are carrying. Now, also... I'll just use my uh, my own stuff here as a quick example, right? Okay, so we're going to go to my orders and uh, quantity, pure solvent, okay? So pure solvent I'm selling right now from First Light, 6,771. When this auction expires in 23 hours, it will go back into the storage shed and then it will put it overweight, meaning I can't sell anymore. But if I wanted to sell something else from my storage, which I'm just going to use the menu to show you what's in the storage. So let's say I wanted to sell, um, like, this aged tannin instead, right? But when the solvent goes in here, it's going to put it all overweight. So all I have to do, assuming I don't also sell the solvent, is simply drop it on the ground and- Whoa, what the heck? Did y'all see that? I, like, flew backwards. That's weird, huh? Hmm. Uh, we're- I don't know what's going on with that. So let, let me just educate you real quick on items, okay? You can, like, right now, my character can carry around 2,200-something pounds before he can't move anymore. You can still kind of slow crawl and slow walk around, right? Now, all I have to do is go to my stash, like, say, if, let's say this was Brightwood, and just take everything out of, out of the, the storage that I want to sell, as much as I can carry, lug it over here, and then drop it on the ground. Now, when you drop something on the ground, look at this. Uh, just go ahead and read this. This, this is something they knew they added to the game, okay? Other players can't see it. They can't take it. And this will disappear after three minutes. Well, guess what? Y you can easily drop a bunch of stuff on the ground from your storage. Go list the auctions you want. Um, that way you have room. And you'll be fine. And if you want to reset the timer, pick it up. Oh, no, you're overweight. Put it back down. It resets the timer. Okay, that's all you have to do to uh, to be able to sell anything with a full storage and what what the heck is going on? <laughs> Why do I keep teleporting backwards? What in the heck? Anyway, guys, <laughs> anyway, guys, <laughs> that keeps happening. Like, is it the stairs doing it? Is it? Am I like slipping? I don't. Man, this game, this, this, it's patch day. Things are broken. This game is so buggy and busted. <laughs> Let me just sort this back to one penny. Okay, so what I'm getting at is if you want to just mass store things, like, for instance, everything here in Brightwood, I'm just holding on to this until I start playing the game seriously again because all this stuff is useful for crafting. If I ever wanted to, like, turn wire fiber into infused, you know, silk, then, then I have plenty, okay? If I want to sell it, I can just dump a bunch of crap on the ground that's heavy until my storage limit goes down, list this on the market, list the things that I put on the ground back on the market, and then go to another town and cancel them, and it's back in the storage. Simple as. And let me tell you, like, right now, if I wanted to, like, list... The, the cost to list this solvent, 6,000 of it, was, like, I think, like, nine, nine coin, okay? 
the cost that you're paying to rent a house is like a lot more than that for what a couple hundred more pounds of storage or maybe 800 pounds more of storage it's not enough storage you will never have enough storage by even having the best chests in the game and and having all your houses in one town is still not enough storage in this game guys i'm telling you but you can easily abuse the fact that the market sends it to storage regardless of how much it can hold and you can just use the market for cheaper for for better storage that's all i've really got for this video uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna drag it out for eight minutes. Uh, what's whatever, man. I'm so busy. Thanks for watching. As always, be a bro and stay swole. And let me know if your character does that sliding backwards off stairs thing. Like that's hap that's been happening a lot lately. I don't know what's going on with that, man. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Videos every single day. Take care.